Herzlich willkommen zu Protec Academy. Welcome to the Trotec Academy. In this video tutorial, we are going to show you how to get the best results from your Trolase laminates. You will be guided step by step to the final result and learn helpful tips and tricks for your daily laser work. Enjoy watching the video. What will be shown? Importing your graphics, resizing, size adjustments, defining cut lines, printing tips. What is needed? Trolase 0.8 mm. Honeycomb table, 1.5 or 2 inch lens, depending on your artwork. Paper tape. To start with, open your graphics program and design or import your artwork. In this case, we are using Coral Draw, but feel free to design in the graphics program of your choice. Once your graphics have been designed or imported, please verify that they are available in the black and white mode. This will avoid any unnecessary half toning when printing. If you have designed or imported a vector file, select all of the graphics and group them by pressing Ctrl plus G or by using the context menu by clicking the right mouse button. Once the artwork has been grouped, you can select the graphics and modify the size. By hitting the P key, you can enter your selected graphics on the page. In order to cut out the artwork, a cut line needs to be generated. Draw a rectangle and specify it as a hairline or 0.001 mm and as RGB color red, R255, G0, B0. Selecting the rectangle and hitting the P key will also center your cut line on the page and hence make it match your engraving artwork perfectly. You are now ready to send your print job to the laser. Please select all items and conduct the print command. Control P. Select your Trotec engraver from the list of available printers. We will now guide you through the relevant print process settings before you can start the actual laser process. Enter a size which is bigger than your graphic. Select Minimize to Job Size. The actual size settings can be even bigger as job control will automatically optimize the size to suit your artwork. Select the respective material from your materials database. You can choose from the main group and the actual subcategory. Once complete, please define the following process options. Process, standard, resolution, 500 DPI, cut line, none, as you have already drawn one in your artwork. Half toning, black, white, or color. Both will work in this case, as your artwork does not contain any color besides the red cutting line. Select the Enhanced Geometries feature for perfectly smooth cutting edges. You are now ready to send your file to Job Control, Trotex Job Management Software. Click the Job Control symbol to proceed to your next step. If Minimize to Job Size has been selected, the preview might be larger than the actual engraving and cutting. This is OK, as the final optimization will be done by Job Control before the actual printing. Click OK to complete the print process. In order to get the best engraving results from your Trolase material, we do recommend engraving from the bottom upwards. Just select the start position in the plate setup menu. The laser will then adjust the rest automatically. Click on the connect button. Your laser job will automatically arrive in your job queue. You can position the job by double-clicking on the job or by dragging the file onto your virtual laser plate. Particularly if you are using leftover material, you may be unsure if the laser job will actually fit onto the remaining part of the sheet. This can easily be verified by using the Outline Jobs feature. Right-click on the laser job and the laser will start to follow the outer dimension of the engraving and cutting. This step can be skipped when not needed. Now remove the protective film from your laminate. If you do not use the entire sheet, only remove parts of the film so that the remaining parts of the laminate sheets will stay protected from scratches. Place the laminate on the honeycomb cutting table and activate the vacuum by turning on the exhaust system. 
Covering the rest of your honeycomb table will increase the vacuum effect even more. For example, you can use paper sheets to do this. You are now ready to focus and start the laser. Use the convenient autofocus feature to bring the table to the right position. If you prefer to use the manual focusing procedure, just follow the steps as described in your owner's manual. Once the laser is in focus, just hit the start button and the laser will start to engrave and cut your laser job. The laser has finished its work. Open the lid and take out your finished application. If there is some dust remaining on your material, you can easily wipe it off with a tissue. Please don't use alcoholic cleaners as they might harm the surface and appearance of your lasered item. Some additional tips and tricks for optimizing your engraving results. Depending on the details featured within your artwork, you can use the Z offset feature within your material database. Within your Trotec materials database, you will find preset values for the different Trolase products. If you do see remaining color shades or areas within your engraving field, please double check the focus and the flatness of the material on the table. This might improve the quality if necessary. Thank you for watching this video from the Trotec Academy. We wish you all the best for your personal laser applications using Trolase materials and are looking forward to welcoming you to our other video tutorials.